and we're back. You can't listen to Major Roberts and not acknowledge that we've got issues. And what I'm doing here is talking to you about what you can do about it, how we can stand strong for America's soul and sanity. And there is a cultural war going on in this country. When you hear Major Roberts say he's been fired because he won't give somebody a grade they didn't earn, that he won't give somebody a 50 when they earned a zero and advance them on to another grade, then seriously, we've got people that have the wrong values here and it's time for us to stand up. He got fired and he got fired alone. Nobody stood up for him. We've got issues in this country. We need to stand up for people like Major Roberts. This is a, this is a time that we need to actively live and support a meritocracy. He's saying we want to reward good performance. We want to reward good behavior. We want to stand by those people who contribute and not those who don't. We don't want to coddle these young people and give them rewards for doing nothing. Because you're cheating the child when you do. That's why I say this is a how-to guide. This is something that will stimulate your thinking about what you're doing in your own life, what you're doing with people that may work for you, what's happening with your children and your grandchildren. This is a guide that is going to get us out of this quagmire and get us to reclaim the narrative in America. And that means you've got to live with intent. And when you see someone victimized like this, when you see a teacher that just simply cannot uh, abide by doing something that is morally uh, reprehensible to him, we need to applaud that. We need to stand up for that. And that's what we've got issues, how to stand strong for America's soul and sanity is all about. Pick it up.